Hello, I'm Tinkerman432, and we're back for another part of Mega Man X. And we're starting Sigma's Sigma's Fortress, the second stage, and this part is pretty dangerous, I'm just gonna get right into the game. These bats, although they're normally harmless, will try to, try to knock you off the edge, and if you're dashing around too much, you might fall like I almost did. But anyway, it's that first area. It was pretty tricky the first time I tried it. But anyway, we have a boss rush, and I'll leave you with awesome music. See you in a moment. Alright, I'm back. So, um, yeah, there are a lot of boss rush. This is, the next few stages have a lot of boss rush, and, uh, so if I'm not talking, then I might not talk a lot. So for this next part, um, you can actually steal this, this armor thing from that guy there before he hops into it, so that's pretty cool. And boss rushes, they are really hard for me to edit. Or at least in this game. In the other games, they have a whole stage for Boss Rush. But anyway, in this game, I have to put the original video, and then pause the original video, and then put in um, another version of the video that's. and then cut it to where the last version left off, speed it up uh, for the. so that way it's shorter, and then put in the music, and then put another video where where it goes back to normal, and if there is more than one boss rush in a stage, then I have to do it several times, which can be very hard. Uh, if you didn't understand that what I just said, that's normal. Just, just take in the thought when I when I said um, that it's hard to edit this. But anyway, let's continue on to the stage. And to this next part, you have to climb a little, and then we'll have another rematch fight, and this one with. Storm Eagle. So yeah. See ya. Yeah, fighting the bosses with their weaknesses is so much easier and in some games, it's a little too easy, like uh, Mega Man X4, for instance. But um, it's still fun. It's still pretty fun. Uh, Refighting re them, and especially if they come out randomly throughout the stage. But that's only in the first Mega Man, Mega Man X. But for this next part, you have to climb up some more, and I'm having a little bit of trouble. Uh, I don't know why. I should be perfectly fine at this game, because I'm, like, the best. Okay, I wouldn't say the best, because I'm not the best. I'm just saying that because I want to make myself feel huge. Kidding. Um, but this next part can be hard for anyone, so don't worry about it. If you want to play the game, expect the final stages to be hard. But now we have another boss, the real boss of this stage, and, um, not gonna do a boss rush because it's not a boss rush. This is actually the boss of the stage, and it's guess what we're fighting? We're fighting the room. Okay, so those things down there are spikes, so you're not gonna want to step like that on them, like I do a few times right now, and like that. <sighs> but anyway, those eyes will come out and they'll attack you. Uh, one version just flies at you. One version shoots you. And what, another version shoots more. It like shoots three. And watch me die again in a few minutes. <laughs> so that blue, and then the walls come in and you have to climb it, climb a little. And then there's the nose that comes out. I think it's the nose and it tries to attack you. So the green one will just shoot you. And then the nose comes back out. And they all have a certain amount of health. But if you destroy the nose, or if you destroy the yeah, if you destroy the nose while while the walls are like that, which is, but the if the eyes are still alive, then the eyes will just sit there and watch this as I epically fail. 
I thought I hit it, but I guess the eye was closed and then I missed it. So yeah, fast forward. Alright, there we go. I almost died again. But, I'm back in the red eyes there on the other side of the room this time. And let's take it down with no more mistakes. Alright. The spikes on the ground will disappear, so that's kinda why I missed la or that's why I died last time. I thought they would disappear, but I missed, so apparently not. So that's Sigma Stage 2, but it looks like we still have some time to do another stage. So why not? Let's do Sigma Stage 3, which, oh, the editing was just horrible, because there's so many boss rematches. But here we are, cool music, that you'll hear very little, because the next, we have a boss. So yeah, we'll see you in a second. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I'm probably not gonna say too much between these boss fights because in this stage they are they are plenty and take up most of the time in the stage. So I'm just gonna not talk about anything except uh, I don't know. Happy 30th anniversary, Mega Man. That'll happen in December of this year, 2017. But anyway, back to the boss fights. Hopefully I don't take too much longer. Um, you may ask how I get those items. You have to take out the boomerang and then they'll uh, grab them for you. So yeah, that's all I have to say for now because I'm probably going to go on saying about something and then I'm going to go into the boss door and then, and then I won't be able to finish my sentence and then that would... No, well, forget it. I'm just going to go through the boss. See you in a minute. Okay, I think we're almost there, so don't you don't have to wait too much longer, but as you probably could have guessed, next is, um, next is, what is his name, Launch Octopus, and as you can tell because the underwater and the fishies, but I'm gonna grab these items and then we're gonna take out Launch Octopus, but bef before I speed up the video and put the music, I'm going to tell you something and show you something pretty cool, I might have mentioned it once or twice. But you can actually cut off Launch Octopus's tentacles, and you can also cut off um, Play Mammoth's trunk. But anyway, let me cut off his tentacles any second. So that's pretty cool, and I'll see you in a second for the music. one more boss left. Um, for this next part we actually have the opportunity to grab a 1-up. So we're gonna take out the the um, chameleon sting, full charge it, and then we'll be invincible for a minute, or a second, or two. So let's grab those and then go to Flame Mammoth, who's the last boss. 
<laughs> Something went wrong in the editing, and for some reason I can't show me cutting off his trunk. But anyway, uh, it's probably gonna fast forward any second now. But, so you can cut off his trunk. And as you can see, now it's missing. But anyway, it should be sped up now, so I'll see you in a second. Okay, good. No more bosses. Let's get this over with once and for all. So here, next boss is not Sigma. We'll have to go one more stage in the next and final episode. But we're not there yet, so... This next boss is a weird tank car, whatever it is, I don't know. And uh, its weakness is the rolling cutter, and you have to hit it. You have to hit it. And you can actually jump on its little car part. But it'll crush you if you stay on top of it when it's vertical to the that. And then it'll also shoot out these lasers. Uh, whatever they are. And then it'll go faster, and then it'll make you fall over because of the uh, the uh, impact on the walls. But I'm going to use my sub-tank because that's what they're for, extra health. And I'm almost done, don't worry. This is taking forever in the editing, so it may, may seem longer to me than you. You should get it, last hit. There we go. And we're done. So yeah, I'll see you in the next episode, whenever that is. Next week, I know when it is. But... Peace and sheep, like and subscribe, and have a good day. I think I already said sheep, so yeah, goodbye.